everybody, we're in Anaheim, California, and they may not be considered mighty anymore, but they are to be. The Ducks are ready to fly. Enough talk, enough hype. Let's do this. Your first period is set to go. The Leafs start with possession as we are now underway. The Ducks take possession in the defensive end. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Slides it on over to Riley. The Leafs move the puck in the defensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Marner. Stick save by Stolarz. Stolarz off to hang on to it to get a whistle. You start to wear down a little bit. You need your goalie to help you out. Johns can score when his head's up, his feet are moving, and he releases the puck before the goalie can get a read on it. He's known for his off-the-rush zone ability. Matthews wins the draw. They'll look to set up here offensively. And play rolls on as he came up with a nice stop there. Takes a bump but still hangs on to the puck. Taken by Fowler. Anaheim's in transition. Poked away at center by Marner. And he takes the pass. His reflexes on display tonight. He tracks his puck perfectly to get himself into position for this save. This is not an easy one. Right from the middle of the ice. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Seeger setting up against the wall. Oh, they probably want to redo on that. Nylander's into the offensive zone now on the attack. Slides it quickly to Silverberg. And he handles a cross-ice pass. Quick pass to Silverberg. The Leafs scoop it up along the boards. Slick feed. Quick pass to Yarncro. What an opportunity, and they can't convert. That's a chance you just don't get back, obviously, James. I, I mean, you're, you're right in a scoring position, and you don't even test the goalie. And the puck's booted away. And that battle along the wall comes to an end. And now it's over to Tavares. Couldn't complete the play. Toronto's got the puck along the boards. Gaining momentum along the wing. Good heads up defense, and he scores! got the game's first goal. Now they'll play in front. Best place to be, of course, is out in front where you set the pace. The other guys have to chase you for the rest of the night. The Leafs get a hold of the puck off the draw. Great defensive effort with the stick. James, he's only one goal away from the next plateau. He's really working the puck now. to get this game back to even. Now we'll see who can grab momentum. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Face off here in the neutral zone and we are back underway. Anaheim's got a hold of it along the wall. To Comtois. On the attack along the boards. Couldn't connect, although not exactly an ideal pass to begin with. Gaining speed through center, and here they come on the attack. Scrum along the boards. And the puck's knocked loose. Camp's looking to make something happen here in the corner. Here he is. Hey, and he's up and running this season. Look at the relief on his face already. He hasn't even played many games, but you want this as early as you can. The Leafs get a leg up here by one. Plenty of time left here, but you still have to be happy that you're in the lead. Toronto's won the draw. Takes the feed. Anaheim's gained possession along the boards. We got a whistle offside the call. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck.
McTavish has won the draw inside the neutral zone. Shot denies him! Stolarz tracks that puck perfectly. He's in position, and he makes an excellent save. And a great read to turn that play aside. I like the way he tracks the puck here. He's got to find it, and then he gets his body right in front of it. That's a good save. The Ducks played along the boards. The Leafs get a hold of the puck. Takes the feed. Moves the puck. All alone! And he's got the answer for that one. Robinson's exploring options with the puck. Long reach breaks up the momentum. The Ducks will play it in their own end. Nice pass. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Moves it to Marner. Oh, he had the right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. The Leafs will play it from the defensive zone. Inside the offensive end, now down the left. Pad save. He's on it tonight. The Ducks get a hold of the puck along the boards. Looks to pass it to Matrano. Moves the puck along the half wall. Here's a short pass to Polia. The Leafs have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Matthews. And now he moves it to Johns. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. And he easily stops that one. Stolarz is going to wait for a breather as he swallows up the puck. Well, now everybody can get themselves back to their square one position. I mean, it was starting to look a little ragged in the defensive zone. It's a good play by the goaltender. Seekers wins possession in the defensive zone. Battle along the boards. Unable to reach that one. Quick pass to Matrano. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Nylander. Slides it diagonally to Terry. Anaheim's moving the puck through center ice. Picked up along the wall by Terry. Here they come on the attack down the right side. And he regains control of the puck. Takes a whack, but still hangs on. Stopped by the goaltender. Gets a hold of the puck from the right side. Let's move to the middle. They've got numbers. Oh, they couldn't connect on the play. The Ducks have it against the wall. Looking for space inside the D zone. Slides it across to Henrique. Quick feed to Giordano. Official blows the play dead as the puck goes out of bounds. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. Center's jammed up and the winger grabs the puck. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Jones. And that's a great read to force the turnover. There's the buzzer. Fans seem to enjoy that first 20 minutes. We'll get to the second period right after both teams get a chance to catch their breath. Stick around. All right, I think my partner in crime, Ray Ferraro, is rested and refreshed along with the teams. We're ready to get things underway. Well, let's see what we can get for an encore here as period number two is underway. Ray, what's your assessment of the game to this point? The Ducks have to rebound after that sluggish start, James. It's like they had the heavy boots early in that first period. They never had the puck, and as a result, they're chasing this game right now. Takes the pass. Zegras brings it in from center. The Ducks take it from the side. And not much on that one. We see goaltenders in this butterfly practicing it every day. Positioning, keeping their arms tight, making sure that they stay in the center of the puck. Still plenty of time left in this frame. 
The Leafs lead it 2-1 in what has been an entertaining game thus far. Tavares wins the draw on their own end. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Driving right to the front! Stolars has the puck, and he'll wait for the faceoff. I think that's a pretty heady play. There's been a little bit of scramble around him, and he jumps on it. They can get reorganized. Both teams are set. We'll drop the puck here. The Ducks get a hold of the puck in their own end. And now he angles it across to Silverberg. And that's broken up. Sends it over to Tavares. Toronto's on the attack. Handles the pass. Oh, and he gets a piece of that one to keep it out. High quality chance, high quality save. Taken along the wall by Nylander. From one point man to another. Oh, the home team is reeling here inside the defensive zone. The fans are nervous. And they'll skate it out of the zone. Anaheim's got it along the wall. Moves it to Comtois. And look at this. We're all tied up. There's a part of this game that looked like it was going to get away from them. Get the hobby in there. The goalie made a couple of good stops. And here they are. They get the big play. And this game is hot. Anaheim's counter punch pays off. They even things up here in the second. They've had really good legs since the start of this period, and it seemed like a matter of time before they'd punch through. Toronto's won it. And now he moves it quickly to Kerfoot. Some great thievery in the open ice. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Comtois. Here's a short pass to Lundstrom. And that's intercepted by Hall. The Leafs move to the offensive zone. Toronto's got the puck against the half wall. And that's blocked from someone in front. Goss Despair is just so strong on the puck. Even though he stumbled, he was able to keep that play alive, make the pass, and they get a chance on goal. Pinned up along the boards. To the low slot. Big time stop. Oh, wow. Keeper. Goalie coaches are always working on following and tracking the puck. He stops one. Now you got to stop the second. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. And now he tries to get it across to Grant. And that doesn't exactly go tape to tape. And it's a quick pass to Barner. And he comes up with it. Stolarz gobbles up the puck and he'll wait for the whistle. Oh, now you got a chance to get organized again. The freezing is a good safe play. Still lots of time left here in this frame. We are all tied up in this one. Anaheim's won the draw. Grabbed along the board by Drysdale. Carrying the puck deep inside his own end. Musa quickly over to Grant. Puck scooped up by Leeson. Takes the feed from off the boards. Picked up along the boards by Grant. Toronto's got the puck in their own end. Ahead of steam now towards the front. Anaheim's got a hold of it against the wall. Quick pass to Polia. Receives the pass. Off the post and into the back of the net. Just a quarter of an inch keeps that puck out. If it hits the post more directly, it stays out. And you're a shooter. That's a great sound. Toronto's got in front here in the second. What are you hearing between the benches? Nobody's really that comfortable. I mean, they're happy, of course, they've got the lead, but this is going to stay close. The Leafs win the faceoff. Up along the wing. Muzzin's going to play it against the half wall. Now a quick pass to Terry. Handles the puck. Poked away in the neutral zone by Marner. Puck grabbed by Lilgren. Look at this, it's a two-on-one. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Nylander. The Leafs cross the line and gain the zone. Makes a move and the puck hops away from him. The Ducks scoop it up along the boards. Down the left wing and into the offensive zone. Quick feed to Matrano. 
for point blank. He scores! And it's T-square, Troy Terry, who puts it home. Past the midway mark of the frame, James and Ray with you tonight. We got a tie game. The Ducks win the draw here in the neutral zone. Poked away at center by Yarncroft. The Leafs gain possession. And he takes the feed. Read that perfectly with the poke check. Slides the puck to Jones. Toronto's got the puck. And he takes the dish. Anaheim's got it across the line. Moves it to Silverberg. The Leafs gain possession in their own end. And he shut the door on that last play. Denies him again! Strom's able to stay in the play after he stumbles. Still gets the shot. That's a terrific effort. And makes the routine save. Stolarz is going to hang on for a whistle and get a breather here for his team. That guy starts to run around. You get a little weary. That's an important cover. Getting into the later stages of this period, you can feel... Feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Robertson's won the draw. And he slides it quickly to Brody. Here's a chance. Fires the wrist shot. Stop that one. He's been really good on these high danger chances. And here's another one right from the slot. But he's trapped that puck to keep it in front of him and make the save. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Toronto's got the puck. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. And now it's grabbed by Shattenkirk. Let's it go. Oh, break out the ice packs. He lays out to block that shot. Ow. Sends a pass over. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. They're like a swarm of bees out here with this pressure. Towards the pitch to Hall. Less than a minute to go here in the second. Sends it down low. Centering in front. And he denies that great opportunity there. And both centers glide into the dot as a face-off set to resume. Clock is dropped and we are back underway. The Leafs move it in. Here's a short pass to Lilgren. Let's it go. And there's the save. And there's the buzzer bringing the second period to an end. You don't want to go home yet, do you? Third period action still to come. The officials are set, the players are set, Ray Ferrar between the benches is set. I'm James Sabolski. let's go. Here we go, we're underway in the third. Everybody having fun getting it on the offensive action. The Ducks gain control of the puck against the wall. With some open space at center. Great pass from the left wing up the middle now. The Leafs take it along the wall. Look at this, they've got some bodies here on the attack. And he slides it quickly to Brody. Slides the puck over. Slides it back to the blue line. Huge blocker saved by Stolarz. Scooped up along the wall by Fowler. Oh, look at this. Scores! The huge go-ahead goal has changed the landscape in this one. Yeah, a critical goal here at a critical time. The game's tied. You're looking for somebody to make a play. Who's going to step up? There it is. They've got the lead. The Leafs have gone ahead here in this third period. They'll want to continue to be aggressive, though, James. They don't have enough of a cushion to sit back. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Looking to make something happen along the boards. And some good footwork to kick it away. Toronto's looking to break out. Along the right side into the offensive zone. 
Anaheim's crossed the line and on the attack. Here's a chance, and that's stopped. Toronto's got it along the wall. From the point, looks to make something happen. Lucky bounce for the goaltender as it goes off the inside of the iron and stays out. Toronto's lead does not change. It just needed a bounce there as this puck hits the post and stays out. Moves it quickly over to Riley. And now he moves it to Nylander. And that's poked away by Kulikov. Quick pass to Silverberg. Toronto's got the puck along the wall. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. The Leafs have it now. Puck sent over to Kerfoot. The Ducks look to start the transition game. The Leafs gain control of it. Here they come up along the wing. Anaheim's got the puck along the boards. Drives it to the crease. Shots and they get it back. Now back to level square. You want them to be as aggressive as possible. You've got the other team reeling really a little bit. The Ducks have made this a game once again here in the third. Oh, set up for a race to the finish now. Tied here in the middle portion of the third period. Anaheim's won the draw in the neutral zone. Sends it in on the attack. Gostas Bears taking it from his own end. Anaheim's gained possession along the boards. Crisps on top of that for the whistle. Pretty quickly on top of it to kill the play. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. It's all tied up. Anaheim's won the faceoff. Stops him cold. Johns takes the puck. Toronto's on the attack. Marner's got control of the puck in the corner. The Ducks gain control of the puck. Now he takes it over the line. Shot! And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Moments away from the face-off. Let's get back to the action. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. The Ducks ready to go on the attack. Handles that one. He reads the play to get across in the butterfly, but you still have to be agile because that puck can change directions on you. Chris is good at covering the net and making himself look as big as possible while down in the butterfly position, guys. That's his butterfly effect, zone ability, and it's what helps him come up with the big stops. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Oh, the double G in the house! The great glove save! Toronto's got a hold of the puck. Mustn't stick handling in his own zone. Great cross ice pass. Anaheim's got control of it now from their own end. Dumps it in. Toronto's got possession of the puck. Slides it over with pace to Kulikov. Nice feed. Denies him in close. The Leafs get a hold of the puck along the boards. Dishes it to Engvall. Giordano's got it in the offensive zone. Quick feed to Shattenkirk. Anaheim's got a hold of the puck. Tosses it on to Jones. The Ducks take it along the wall. Jones will play it from the side. And now it's over to Polio. And he takes the feed. Chris is going to opt for the whistle and give everybody a chance to breathe. Sometimes you get running around as the shift gets long. This helps. Here in the back half of this period, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. And from off the wing, he comes up with it with both centers scrummed up. 
Toronto's got it in their own zone. Through center along the wing. Great heads up play with the stick by Drysdale. Silverberg's got it along the boards. Here's a shot and makes the save. Here's a shot. No room for that one to get through. Along the boards, they battle for the pop back and forth. And that's just out of reach. Pushes it across to Tavares. Looks to get the puck over to Gostaspare. Fires it on net. And he gets just enough to keep it out. Standing by Carlin Bays with her own thoughts on the head-to-head -head matchup tonight. John's had the better finishing touch, and that's what made him stand out in our matchup, guys. I'm giving him the edge here in this one tonight. Toronto's won the draw. And now he moves it quickly to Brody. Shot in front! And he gets just enough of it to keep it out for the back of the net. Tries to get the puck over to John's. Throws it in. Battle along the wall. Pass to Matrano. Cutting to the slot. Matthews gets a hold of the puck in the corner. The Leafs will play it against the boards. Whoa. And we go to Leader as he tucks it into the net. These teams are jammed together. That goal might open it up. Toronto's gone ahead here by one in the third. What's the message now for the stretch run, Ray? To be aggressive. Too often teams sit back on their heels. They give up a chance. They give up a power play. Pretty soon it's an all-out scramble. Puck picked up by Riley. Rolls around along the half wall. Here he is in front. Fantastic save. Certain saves are more difficult than others. This one right from the slot is turned aside. And it's a quick pass to Terry. A breakaway. Oh, he's got a step. All alone. Oh, what happened? Uh, I think James, too much time, too many options, and you can't pick anything. Pretty soon, it's nothing. Penalty coming up as the play's blown dead. Shorthanded with a one-goal lead. James, that's where the penalty killers earn their bread right now. as the man advantage unit takes to the ice. Less than 60 seconds left here in the final frame. The Leafs have it against the wall. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. The Ducks take possession in the... Henrique's got it against the boards. Anaheim's emptied the net. The extra attacker's now out on the ice. Gets it out of his own end. The Ducks gain possession along the wall. Moving into the attacking zone. And they won't connect on that one. Good reach to the stick to knock the puck away. Battling for it along the boards. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Vetrano. That's a really good play, James. You got the lead. It's late in the game. You just want to advance the puck forward. There's no need for a risky play. Here's a chance. And that one's turned aside. And there's the final horn, bringing this one officially to an end. I got to say, as a player, the first period would have been way more fun to play than these last two. That looked like work. Way more fun to call, and got some goals, all sorts of it. Really settled down, though, down the stretch. Now, wildness always makes entertaining games. Great night of action on the ice, and I can't wait to do it again. I know you can't wait either, so we'll see you next time, and real soon at that.